Welcome everyone to my first reading of the week as Supergirl. I hope you guys enjoy this series I'm going to do. Um, I hope it entertains the children out there who are bored out of their heads and have to stay inside. Love you guys. So the first story I'm going to read is set a classic one by Dr. Seuss. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. So we're gonna get started with this. One fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Black fish, blue fish, old fish, new fish. This one has a little star. This one has a little car. Say what a lot of fish there are. Yes, some are red and some are blue, some are old. And some are new, some are sad, and some are glad. And some are very, very bad. Why are they sad and glad and bad? I do not know. Go ask your dad. Some are thin and some are fat. The fat one has a yellow hat. From there to here, from here to there, funny things are everywhere. Here are some who like to run. They run for fun in the hot, hot sun. Oh me, oh my, oh me, oh my, what a lot of funny things go by. Some have, some have two feet, and some have four. Some have six feet, and some have more. Where do they come from? I cannot say. But I bet they have come a long, long way. We see them come, we see them go. Some are fast, and some are slow. Some are high, and some are low. Not one of them is like another. Don't ask us why. Go ask your mother. Say, look at his fingers. One, two, three. How many fingers do I see? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He has eleven. Eleven. This is something new. I wish I had eleven too. He has eleven fingers, guys and gals. Do you have 11 fingers? I don't. I only have 10. Bump! Bump! Did you ever ride a wump? We have a wump with just one hump. But we know a man called Mr. Gump. Mr. Gump has a seven hump wump. So, if you like to go bump, 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 and just jump on the hump of the womp of gump. So many humps, look at that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Holy moly. Oh 
almost reminds me of a can camel, but there's a lot of humps. Who am I? My name is Ned. I do not like my little bed. This is no good. This is not right. My feet feel sick. Out of bed all night. And when I pull them in, oh dear, my head sticks out of bed up here. Looks like Ned is having a rough night's sleep. Do you fit in your bed? I do. We like our bike. It is uh, made for three. Our mic sits up and back, you see. We like our mic, and this is why Mike does all the work when the hills get high. Isn't Mike a really nice guy? Look at that, he is helping out. Helping out his friends. Do you help out your friends? I do. Hello there, Ned. How do you do? Tell me, tell me, what is new? How are things in your little bed? What is new? Please tell me, Ned. I do not like this bed at all. A lot of things have uh, come to call. A cow, a dog, a cat, a mouse. Oh, what a bed, oh, what a house. Oh no. Now Ned has a bunch of animals in his bed. That's rough. Do you have a pet? I do. I have a kitty cat. She likes to sleep with me at, all the time on my bed. Sometimes she hogs the whole bed. Oh dear, oh dear, I cannot hear. Will you please come over near? Will you please look in my ear? There must be something there, I fear. Say look, a bird was in your ear. He is out. So have no fear. Again, your ear can hear, my dear. Have you ever had a bird in your ear before? I haven't. I don't think it'd be very comfortable. My hat is old. My teeth are gold. I have a bird I like to hold. My shoe is off. My foot is cold. My shoe is off. My foot is cold. I have a bird I like to hold. My hat is old. My teeth are gold. And now my story is all told. Do you have a pet bird and gold teeth? I do not. This guy does. We took a look. We saw a nook on his head. He had a hook. On his hook, he had a book. Oh, his book was how to cook. We saw him sit and try to cook. He took a look at the book on the hook. But a nook can't read. So a nook can't cook. So what good to a nook is a hook cook book. Do you know how to read? Most of the time I can't read. Sometimes I have, I just can't read. <laughs> the moon was out and we saw some sheep. We saw some sheep take a walk in their sleep. By the light of the moon, by the light of a star, they walked all night from near to far. I would never walk. I would, I would take a car. Walking, sleeping sheep. Talk about counting your sheep when you're going to sleep. <laughs> I do not like this one so well. 
all he does is yell, yell, yell. I will not have this one about. When he comes in, I put him out. This one, it's a quiet is as this one is quiet as a mouse. I like to have him in the house. This one's the yelling and this one's the quiet one. house we open cans. We have to open many cans. And this is why we have a Zans. A Zans for cans is very good. Have you have you a Zans for can? You should. I wish I had a Zans for cans. But what I have is a can opener. I like to box. How I like to box. So every day, I box a gox. In yellow socks, I box my gox. And uh, I box in yellow gox box socks. It's fun to sing if you sing with a ying. My ying can sing like anything. I sing high and my ying sings low. And we are not too bad, you know. Do you sing? I do. This one, I think, is called a yink. He likes to wink. He likes to drink. He likes to drink and drink and drink. The thing he likes to drink is ink. The ink he likes to drink is pink. He likes to wink and drink pink ink. So, if you have a lot of ink, then you should give it, you should get a yink. I think. Hop, hop, hop. I am a yop. I like, all I like to do is hop from finger top to finger top. I hop from left to right and then hop, hop. I hop right back again. I like to hop all day and night from right to left and left to right. Why do I like to hop, hop, hop? I don't know. Go ask your pop. Brush, brush, brush. Come, 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 come. Blue hair is fun to brush and comb. All girls who like to brush and comb should have a pet like this at home. Who is this pet? Say he is wet. You never yet met a pet, I bet, as wet as they let this wet pet get. Did you ever fly a kite in bed? Did you ever walk with ten cats on your head? Did you ever milk this kind of cow? Well, we can do it. We know how. If you ever did, you should. These things are fun and fun is good. Are you there? Hello? I called you up to say hello. I said hello. Can you hear me, Joe? Oh no, I cannot hear your call. I cannot hear your call at all. This is not good, and I know why. A mouse has cut the wire. Goodbye. That silly mouse.
from near to far, from here to there. Funny things are everywhere. These yellow pets are called the Zeds. They have one hair up on their heads. Their hair grows fast. And so fast, they say, they need a haircut every day. Do you need a haircut every day? Who am I? My name is Ish. I, on my hand, I have a dish. I have a dish to help me wish. When I wish to make a wish, I wave my hand with a big swish swish. Then I say, I wish for a fish. And I get fish onto my dish. So if you wish to wish a wish, you may swish for fish with my ish wish dish. At our house, we play out back. We play a game called Ring the Gack. Would you like to play this game? Come down! We have only, we have the only gack in town. Would you play with the gack? Look what we found in the park in the dark. We will take him home. We call him Clark. He will live at our house. He will grow and grow. Our mother like it. Will our mother like this? We don't know. Would your mom like that? He looks a little scary to me. And now, good night. It is time to sleep. So we will sleep with our pet, Zeep. Today is gone. Today was fun. Tomorrow is another one. Every day, from here to there. Funny things are everywhere. And that's the end. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I sure did. There's more to where that came from. I'll, I'm going to do my best to try to do different characters in different books all week to keep you entertained. Have a wonderful Monday. I hope to see you guys later.